In today's episode, we make Evie pretty again, we take some of our Caribbean crew sailing, and we bring you along on our summer sail. But first, my diving examination. It's been a challenge to find me a diving class for handicapped people that was affordable, so Torben has been teaching me how to dive and helping me for the last year, and when I felt ready, we then had an instructor come and examine me, and luckily I passed. It was really hard, but also a lot of fun. And apparently I'm the first person ever to fall asleep in the back of his power rip on the way back. We are going to bring on crew, like friends and strangers alike. And we wanted to bring some of the people together that will sail with us at the same time in the Caribbean. So we took them out sailing for a day just to let them meet each other and get to know one another and we had a really great day on the water. Mamia? It's not a requirement to know how to handle a boat to come sail with us, because that's easy to learn. More important to us is their social ability and their personality. Hello here. Yeah. Yeah. We learn to leave the platform. There could be ice up the deck. Minor detail. We knew she had been used and needed some love, and we wanted to try and restore her original color and shine. So we had an offer from a professional company, but that was way out of our budget. So Torben took on the job himself and had some help from our good friend. The surface is not a gel coat, but spray painted like a car, so it needed a lot of polishing to take away the oxidation from the paint and get the color back. And when they were done polishing, they polished some more. To finish it off, 
they gave it sealer and then hard wax and hand polished it. You scratch my back, I scratch yours. <laughs> so this is what the boat looks like before. And this is what it looked like 10 hours later. Another checked item from the list, more anchor chain. We doubled our chain, so now we have 110 meters of 10 millimeter chain. And we will attach the chain to the boat so it can't fall out by accident. But we also put a piece of rope in the end, so we can cut it loose quickly if we need to. So that's just place. With that done, we are ready to go on summer vacation. They have a mini more. Hi, best man. Yeah, I beat myself. No. We are. We're in a pretty busy uh, area right now. So I'm trying to sit up front and navigate and we're communicating via radio so I can tell him in which direction the ships are coming. Found the best spot on the boat in the sunshine. Just took down the sails and we are headed towards Oskilefjord to spend a few days there. It's our holiday now, so the weather is turning out to be nice now. Skal vi gå ned til fælde af? Jeg kan stadig ikke se lysene. Jo, der er rød, rød. De to sidste, alle røde. First time we're crossing under this bridge. We're supposed to have two meters above our mast, but you're, you're always a little bit nervous. Oh. Okay, Hopefully we're not losing the windex. Okay, I think there's about a meter or something. We made it, but that was close. Tricky waters in Roskilde Fjord. Yeah, mm -hmm. he looks a bit like DiCaprio with that hair. <laughs> That's a mini DiCaprio. <laughs> the beach. Det er 
Og så klatrer jeg på Getting ready to receive guests. We are here at Anger in Katzingevi in Roskilde Fjord. We just prepared some some cheese and some and some sausages and everything. And now Torben's dad and his wife is coming. Torben just picking them up from shore. Vi er fremme. 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 Vi er Så tager den anden skal. On our summer vacation in Roskilde Fjord, we also visited Frederikssund and there they had these Viking games and the kids just loved it and we went to see this great play. The Viking play was both interesting and also really amazing to see 200 people on stage and live horses and it was a great experience. Catching anything? No. So, But biscuits for dinner? Yeah, well, if you don't put a line out, you don't catch anything. So, Danish summer at its best. I'm sitting here with my winter jacket on almost. This is why we are sailing south soon. <laughs> We're doing like the birds. We are migrating south because this sucks, actually. So It's like 15 degrees or something. Yeah. Windy, windy. clouded. Yeah, it's just really <clears throat> weather. We haven't had much summer this year, only a few days. So, yeah, next year will be much better. Be sure to watch our next episode, where we change the beam for the top bearing on the rudder while we're still in the water. And we also sand and oil our cockpit, and we service a diver compressor, and a lot more. Thanks for watching, see you next time.